Hi, in this video I will show you the full DIY build of the MCVC, a 4 voice MIDI 2CV converter. The whole build will take up about 45 minutes, but in this video we will take the fast lane. This video is an addition to the DIY manual which you can find on our website. We unpack the kit and turn on the soldering iron. Make sure not to inhale the solder fumes by opening up a window or even better, use a fume extractor. Now, let's begin. We start off by soldering the 8 pin IC socket first. I like to start with soldering one pin first and then check its position. Mind the orientation of the IC socket. Then I solder the remaining pins. Next up are the capacitors. Place them in position and solder the legs. After soldering, snap off the remains of the legs. Now we move on to the trimming potentiometer. Note that the adjusting screw is directed to the left, so that you can trim easily without the need of removing the panel. Solder the pins and snap off the remains of the legs. Now let's solder the mini jacks. First we're gonna place them and use the panel to ensure that everything fits correctly. Use something to support the panel while soldering so the jacks will be pushed against the panel. First, solder one pin of each jack socket and then check if they're all aligned correctly. If so, solder the remaining pins. If not, readjust by heating up the first pin. When the mini jacks are in place, we move on to the switch. Place the switch as straight as possible and solder the legs. Flip the switch downwards and check its placement by placing the front panel. Take off the panel again, so we can solder the headers. There are two types of headers, a 16 pin and a 6 pin. Mind the orientation of the headers indicated on the silk screen. Now we're going to place the LEDs. Please mind the orientation of the LEDs. Place the LEDs but do not solder them yet.
place the standoffs on the PCB using the 3mm screws. We're going to use the front panel so that the LEDs will be at the correct height. I like to use a piece of tape to keep the LEDs in place. And solder just one pin of each LED. Then check if they're flush with the front panel. If so, I solder the remaining pins. The next step is to solder the MIDI connector, but first put the panel in place. Start with one pin and check if its placement is correct. If so, we can solder the remaining pins. Now we move on to the calibration procedure. Connect the MCVC to your Eurorack power supply. Use a digital multimeter to measure the DC voltage between two pins. While measuring, trim the trimming potentiometer and try to get a DC voltage of 10.6 volts. After this, insert the DIN MIDI connector. Connect the cable to the pitch output of the MCVC and measure its DC voltage. While measuring the pitch output, Play a A on a keyboard that gives you 3 volts output. If the reading is a bit off, try to trim using the trimmer potentiometer to get a reading as close as possible to 3 volts. Play the A note an octave higher and check if its output is 4 volts. After this calibration step, your MIDI to CV converter is in tune. Thanks for watching and enjoy your module.